welcome to today's lesson. My name is Iene Akwan. Today, we'll be looking at applications of IT in everyday life under the theme, Basic Knowledge of Information Technology. By the end of the lesson, you should be able to state the uses of IT in daily activities and identify the impact of IT in daily activities. Information technology, also known as IT, can be referred to as any technology that aids human life. It deals with the use of computer-based tools to input, process, manipulate, transfer, store, or retrieve information. This simply means that any tool that is computerized that can aid in your input, manipulation, transfer, receiving of data can be referred to as information technology. The use of IT has evolved over the years and has greatly brought about a significant difference in our world today. As we earlier stated, information technology is the use of systems or computational tools for the retrieving, storing, processing, and transferring of data. We live in the digital age where information is widely available to a larger population, especially through the use of technology. In our world today, virtually everything we do is with the aid of technology. So we can say that we are in the digital age because information is no longer far-fetched but right at our fingertips. Since early times, Technology has been used in communication. However, it has evolved over the years, transforming from one level to another. Starting from the pre-mechanical age of communication, where carvings on rocks, signs, simple drawings were used. These are examples of carvings that were used in the early times to describe something or pass across an information to a fellow person. We can see diagrams of carvings that were used in the early times to pass across information to a person or a group of people. Now, from that pre-mechanical age, it transformed to mechanical age. Now, currently, we are at the point we see today, which is the electronic age. In our world today, most of the activities carried out in our everyday life are done with the aid of technology. Hardly can anything be done manually or without the use of one form of technology or the other. In our world today, we can say of a fact that almost everything we do is with the aid of one form of technology or the other. From relating with one another, transportation, education, anything you can think of is now with the aid of technology. We'll look at some uses of IT in our everyday life. One, communication. With the aid of technology in the form of telephones, computer, internet, social media, we are able to communicate with each other in a short time more effectively and effortlessly. Unlike before, where you had to send a message to someone and wait approximately two to three months to get a response. Now, in a matter of minutes, you can send a message and expect a reply. It has also helped families to communicate better. For example, through the use of social media like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, we can see pictures of one another without being present with them. We can see this telephone that was invented decades ago where you had to book appointments to make a call to a family, a friend, or a client has now transformed to what we have as mobile phones today where at the click of a button, you can reach a friend, reach a family member, or a client. Also, with the use of emails, we've been able to send messages across the globe in a matter of seconds. Two, agriculture. Productivity is a key factor in the agricultural industry. 
The mode of farming has greatly improved since the introduction of technology. Most farmers make use of motorized equipment like tractors, cultivators, plow, etc. to carry out their farming activities. Technology has helped farmers replace the old ways of farming with machines that are faster and efficient. We can see the tools that are currently used by farmers. This equipment have replaced manual form of labor, which included the use of animals or hand tools to perform farming activities. Now, farmers can attest to the fact that they are being able to produce crops in a shorter and more efficient manner. Education. IT has made a very big change in the education world today. It has enhanced the way knowledge is acquired, transmitted, and stored. Teaching, learning, management of books and resources, research, and so on can be done from anywhere and at any time. In education today, we can say that IT is gradually gaining its ground in the education world. Unlike before, where you had to move far distances to gain knowledge at the comfort of your home or the classroom with the use of technology, we can still acquire knowledge with ease. Today, you can access a full library via a mobile app on any smartphone or tablet rather than go to a physical library to get information you need. Now we can attest to the fact that we have mobile libraries on our phone to get the information you need. Banking. Our banking has been made easier such that we can perform transactions at the click of a button. These transactions may include deposits, withdrawals and or transfer of funds, payment of bills, and so on. They can be done in a banking hall at an ATM or on our smartphones, tablets, or computer systems. For example, if Nkechi wants to send money to her mother, she doesn't have to queue any longer to send the money. Just at the click of a button on her smartphone, she can transfer the money to her mother who is far away from her. Technology has indeed made banking a lot easier. We can also withdraw money, transfer, deposit, and even pay our NEPA bills using technology. So we can say that technology has greatly made banking a lot easier. With electronic banking, moving money has become so simple without having any fears of getting robbed on the way. You can buy anything with a debit card. Nowadays, people move on the streets with large sums of money. But because we use technology now, you may never get to know. So we can say that technology has made banking safer as well. Transportation. Time is money. IT has contributed to efficient transportation. Transportation has become a basic need like food, shelter, and clothing. IT has brought about the use of advanced transport means like cars, trains, airplanes, and so on to go to work, to transport goods, to go shopping, to visit friends and families. In the olden days, we had camels, donkeys as means of transportation. Today, IT has made transportation bookings and reservations very easy, even in the comfort of our homes. Today, if you want to go on a holiday, you can book your flights from the comfort of your home without stepping out of the house, and they are reserved for you and your family. We can say thanks to IT for that. We can see we have an air bus here. We also have airplanes as modes of transportation. Entertainment. IT is used to provide a wide range of entertainment activities. We have digital transmissions that are used to broadcast television and radio programs 
and information through broadcasting or cable for display on a television set or radio. The playing of computer games is an important entertainment activity for many computer users. The internet is used for downloading distribution of music and videos and also booking of tickets for a concert or a visit to the cinema. With the aid of IT, we can watch television programs in our homes. We can book concerts, visits to the cinema also from our homes. We don't need to stand on long queues anymore at the viewing center to see a broadcast or a movie. IT has really, really made a lot of things easier entertainment inclusive. Other applications of IT include health industry, businesses, power industry or electricity, fashion, purchases like buying and selling online, human relationships and so on. The impact of IT in our daily lives. The following are ways in which IT has contributed in the development of our daily lives and the society. For example, today, activities that were once tasking are now considered easy because of IT, speed and reliability. With the use of technology, tasks are accomplished in a more efficient way and more so in a shorter time thereby enhancing productivity level. Now, when your boss gives you a task or when your teacher gives you an assignment to take home, because you now have an app on your mobile device, you are sure to do your assignment in time and submit in time also. So IT has really made a lot of things easier for us. Information is readily at our disposal, which means we don't need to travel far distances to gather information. It can be gotten, shared, and stored with ease. The information we have now can be acquired by any means at any time from anywhere with the use of the internet. You can browse information on the internet and get it in a matter of minutes. Communication is better, faster, and more reliable. A large group of people in different locations are able to communicate with themselves at the same time in either call or video conferencing. Now you can relate with your mother or your father if they are far away from you in no time via a call or video conferencing. You can also share pictures, messages, documents, however you want via IT. In summary, information technology is the use of computer-based tools to impute, process, manipulate, transfer, store, and or retrieve information. In our everyday lives, IT is applied in the following sectors, communication, agriculture, education, banking, transportation, health, businesses, power or electricity, fashion, purchases, that's buying and selling, and even human relationship. The impact IT has brought to our lives include making work easier, faster, more efficient, and more productive. Now, the test section. Question one. In the entertainment industry, IT is used in the following ways except A. Radio and television broadcast B. Video and audio download C. Transfer of funds The correct answer is C. Transfer of funds This is a component of banking and not entertainment Question 2 which of the following is not an impact of IT in our daily lives? Is it A, speed, B, stagnation, C, efficiency? 
The correct answer is B, stagnation. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. See you next time. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, drop a comment, and subscribe to our channel. You can also turn on notifications to stay updated on new videos on this channel. This brain friend video was brought to you by Sinforest. For more of these amazing e-learning videos, get your copy of Brain Friend. With more than a thousand e-learning videos, over 74,000 test items in more than 40 subjects, a career counseling guide, and many other amazing features, BrainFriend remains your foremost e-learning and exam preparatory software. BrainFriend. Learn better. Make excellent grades.